Alright, so we're back, and uh, I'm going to talk about my stealth class. I named it Ninja, um, just because. Uh, the, the one thing I forgot to talk about is uh, camo, and really camo, um, when you're trying to be as stealth as possible, you want to choose a camo that's right for your environment, rather as wanting to have like the red tiger all the time. Um, just if you want to be a bit more hidden. It's not such a big deal, but I usually like to go with digital regardless of what I have on, because I'm often, in, 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 this, in this class at least, I'm often running around um, in uh, suburban type areas and buildings and whatnot. Anyways, let's get to it. And right away, my sidearm is the USP, because um, this kind of one I like, but I'm, gonna, I'm starting to try the um, M9, so I'm switching my class as we go. Um, <clears throat> Special grenades, same thing, it's either stun or um, flash. I'm getting used to flash grenades, so I'm going to switch it anyways. Perk 1. Perk 1 is big on the ninja class. Um, you really, um, the special grenades or bomb squad is really the only thing I can tell you to use. Bandolier maybe, but it's a lot help, more helpful to have bomb squad on or the special grenades. I like to go with the bomb squad. Um, UAV Jammer is a must for a ninja class, there's really nothing else you could put on. Same with Dead Silence. Um, with, with this setup, you're basically undetectable unless somebody sees you, um, and you have to have the silencers on. Um, that's basically it I can say for it, except for going through the kind of weapons we can do for the complete stuff class. And really it's anything, like you can use your AK-47, your M4, your G3, your G36, um, your M16, everything that you can put a silencer on will do well with the Ninja class. Um, I generally like to stay away from the, from the G36 the, and the M4 just because I'm not a big fan of the sights on them. The G3 has a sight um, identical to the MP5, so that's why I like to use that one um, a lot as well um, for my Ninja class. The AK-47 also has a nice sight, um, so I also like to throw that one on sometimes for my ninja. Um, but often I go with the submachine guns. Um, AK-47U uh, works nicely. Same, um, I'm using the MP5. The Scorpion is kind of a ridiculous weapon in my mind. Um, it shoots a lot. It shoots pretty fast and. Um, Whatnot, but as you can see, I've only got the red dot for it. Um, there's a good reason for it. Um, the mini Uzi, um, I'll talk about that in my test class, but I wouldn't really suggest it either. I like to go with the MP5. Um, it's my personal favorite, and really what you're looking for in your weapon when you're doing stealth uh, class is you want to make sure, even with the silence, um, even with the silencer on, which will reduce the hip, um, will reduce the uh, recoil. Um, you want to make sure that you can still fire at um, a range that's anywhere over the first notch, because you'll notice on range, there's a couple of notches here. You might not be able to see it. There's a notch there, there, and there. If your notch is anywhere from this below, it's probably not a good idea, but mine's right on the line, and that's where I like to keep it. Um, Anyways, so, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for the Ninja class. Um, another side note is um, I'll try and give you a little footage of each class in play. Um, but, yeah, anyways, uh, we'll, we'll move on next time with a, um, another class. Oh, I might want to add to add as well um, the use of um, extreme conditioning versus the dead silence. Um, I like to put the dead silence on um, sometimes, but if you've been in a match for a while and you're still playing the same kind of guys and you kind of understand how they play, you'll know um, if or not they use their ears or not. If nobody's using their ears, and it's quite noticeable because you can be walking, sneaking up behind them and they won't know that you're there, but they'll still turn around because they'll hear you. You'll know that dead silence is a good choice to uh, put on because then they won't hear you. Mind you, people often don't like to don't use the um, they don't like to use these um, their ears and they often watch uh, UAVs and they'll um, spin around and stuff like that then you might want to go with extreme conditioning 
mind you, it's you can still some still sometimes people will listen to you. I like to go with the dead silence anyways, because if you play with a strong player, they'll always be using their ears against you. Um, UAV jammer, all I can say is it's a must. Um, <coughs> um, mind you, uh, well, yeah, I guess that's all I can really say. Um, next time we will talk about sniper classes.